it's 11.45, Sunday night, I'm Bobby Fanagan. And I'm Tom Claiborne, and you're listening to New, New England, England Tiger Talk. Talk. <laughs> <laughs> this is the forum for us New England Tiger enthusiasts to talk about the majestic beauty and mystery that is the New England Tiger. That's right, so if you have a tiger and live in the New England area, give us a call! <laughs> We're going to talk about, um, oh, here we have our first caller. Go ahead, call him. Uh, yeah, hi, Tiger Talk. Uh, I'm wondering what uh, you guys thought the chances were winning the division this year. <laughs> uh, sorry, caller. Uh, this is not a sports program. Uh, this is a program where we talk about real tigers. Specifically, tigers native to the New England area. <laughs> if yeah. you saw a tiger in India, we could not care less about it. No, no. We wouldn't want to talk about that. No. Unless you ship that tiger to New England. That we'd want to hear about. <laughs> so, uh, do you have any questions about tigers, or have you seen a tiger in your area that you'd like to discuss? Uh, yeah, no, no, no. Okay, no. okay great then. Have a tigerific evening, caller. Uh, yeah, hey, are, are there any tigers in New England? <laughs> Y'all listening to New England Tiger Talk. The New England source for all things tigers. See any tigers this week, Tom? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I actually did. Uh, I took the wife and kids to the zoo, and we looked at Gilly the Bengal. Lovely. Yeah. Uh, stock and pray at all, was he? Uh, no. No, not really. Uh, a lot of laying in the sun. Warm in that tummy. <laughs> Tigers do enjoy a nice warm belly. Sure do, sure do. Uh, say, Tom, you ever wonder what it would be like to rub your face in Gilly's sun warm tummy fur? Oh. Uh, let me think. Only every day, Bobby. <laughs> Only every day. <laughs> oh, we got another call. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Uh, yeah. uh, go ahead, caller, go ahead. Uh, how you boy doing? Great. Listen, uh, I found me a baby tiger cub out near the creek in the woods. Oh, wow, that sounds like heaven, Carla. Where are you calling from? Uh, Aberdeen, Texas. Uh, yeah, all right. Uh, you know, <laughs> Carla, this is New England Tiger Talk. Uh, Y'all going to want to call Texarkana Tiger Yama. <laughs> this little striped son of a gun down here? Well, uh, no, Carla, we can't. <laughs> you know, because our knowledge and experience is limited to the New England Tiger. <laughs> That's not what you called about. So, good night. Do y'all even have tigers up there? <laughs> okay, it's time for our favorite segment now, uh, Tiger Sightings. <laughs> Tiger Sightings, brought to you by Perina. Pampy a little tiger with Perina Kitten Chow. Kittens love it! And now here's Tom with Perina Kitten Chow Tiger Sightings. There have been zero tiger sightings. <laughs> <laughs> and that was Tom with today's Perina Kitten Chow Tiger Sightings. <clears throat> We're gonna kick it over to Carol in the uh, Tiger Traffic Cop to 5000. <laughs> Uh, she is going to give us the latest in tiger traffic. Carol? Uh, there are uh, no tigers on the road. <laughs> Plenty of cars, but, but no tigers. <laughs> Come on, Carol, really? Uh, <laughs> I mean, you check Route 1, that seems like it'd be prime tiger, tiger area. <laughs> seems like they'd be over, prime. I'm over Route 1 right now, Tom. It's yep. pretty jammed with cars, but yeah, no tigers. Okay. All right, well, uh, give us a call if you find any uh, tigers out there, Carol. <laughs> you know, this brings up a good point, actually. What will it take for the legislature in this country to remove their heads from their collective ass and build a series of interstate tiger roads? <laughs> the benefits are twofold. Not only could tigers move safely from place to place without fear of injury, but we could all enjoy the dream I have every single night. 
<laughs> Peaceful tiger man coexistence. Be your mouth to God's ears, Tom. Be your mouth to God's ears. <laughs> well, look at this, a third caller. Here we go. A record broken right here in New England Tiger. You're on, caller. Hey, uh, long time listener, first time caller. Uh, I was wondering, how can I get a pet tiger? A pet tiger? That would be awesome. <laughs> Carla, if you got a pet tiger, please bring him down to the studio so we can pet him. Please. Please. And, and muzzle him, please. Yeah, please do that, Please Carla. do that, Carla, now. Uh, but, but I, don't, I don't know how to get a pet tiger. Please bring him, Carla. You got to bring Just that tiger. Do it, Carla. Carla, 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 do it. Okay. Oh, awesome. Yes. Uh, well, he'll probably be here soon. Uh, in the meantime, before we go to break, uh, Bobby's going to fill us in on what happened today in New England Tiger history. <laughs> this day in New England Tiger history, May 19th, there are no historically significant events in New England Tiger history. Maybe tomorrow we'll break that streak. <laughs> Stick around, everybody. We're talking tigers. Woo! <laughs>